Yorkers love their pizza. You can pick up a 99 cent slice on just about every corner and everyone, but pretty much everyone knows how to enjoy it. Yep, he does. Mm-hmm, him too. Oh wait, except New York's mayor, who took a knife and fork to a New York pizza pie not long ago and will never ever live it down. It's hard to imagine America without pizza, but believe it or not, the first pizzeria in the States was only founded in 1905, right here in Little Italy, Manhattan, by Gennaro Lombardi. The pizza didn't really take off in the States until the 1960s, but from the very first slice right up to today, Pizza's heart has always been in New York City. So you can't come to the Big Apple without trying a big pie, of the pizza variety that is. And I decided to go one better and experience the Pizza Acasa Pizza School, run by husband and wife team Mark and Jenny Bello. My name is Mark Bello. My name is Jenny Bello. This is our place. It's a pizza school. Uh, and we were asked to name our doughs. So my doughs are named Donea. One, two, three, and four. Grow up big and strong, little doughs. Soon they're gonna double in size and then we're going to eat them. Because I couldn't get the thin crust pizza that I loved, grew up with, I started playing around with recipes and making them myself. Here I am 20 years later, and I have a pizza school in New York, specializing in how to make pizza in your home oven, as good as pizza you can get at a pizza. Pizza Acasa's classes run for about four hours and include, trust me, all the pizza you could possibly want or need. It is delicious. From slinging dough to handing out free slices to passers-by, I know I'll always remember this as the coolest cooking class I have ever taken, and I guarantee I will never buy Domino's again. They're both strangers, didn't know each other at the end of class. It's a circle. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody's hugging, sharing pizza. It's a beautiful thing. This is the most fun thing. <laughs> <laughs>